Tanga. Tanga. <laughs> Tanga, yeah. Yeah, I'm a bit forward rather. Okay. Than yeah. it's Matt, Kai and I are, uh, it's a Sunday, we're going for a day drive up our local beaches. Uh, we are on North Shore Beach at the moment, we've just come onto the beach. Matt's driving here, he's keen to test out the new car, keen to have a drive, but he's already got us stuck about 50 metres up the beach. But uh, yeah, today we're going to go for a drive off all our beaches and maybe uh, take on a few sand tracks and along the beaches, a few swimming holes and just enjoy the uh, sunshine weekend Sunday. Good day. Who's keen? Okay. Keen. So your first gear low range yeah. and then put it, is it in? Yeah. yeah so just uh, let your, so let your foot off the clutch with the tiniest bit. You don't need to rev it now. Just so let your foot out with a tiny bit of acceleration as you come out. Yeah, now just, now just go, just don't panic. Now take your foot away from the clutch. Yeah, that's the clutch. Yeah, that's it, now you go. Right. Now just go slow till you get the feel. Now uh, you're about 3,000. Yeah. Now quickly change it to set. And then just get it again. Go, go, go. Yeah, that's it. Alright, you're off. Again, up to about 3,000, then quickly change it to third. And then get it. <laughs> Okay. Oh, Alright, just have number two, boys. start the whole thing again. The car is going to explode, dude. Oh. You're gonna make the car Alright, now stay in fourth. Alright, relax, slow down. Alright. <laughs> the car is going We're in fourth, boys! Woo! <laughs> Matt's gonna <laughs> blow the car up. I know! I'm trying. I'm trying. What do you reckon about Matt's driving? Um, pretty, the car's gonna explode. <laughs> The car is not gonna explode. Every bird is dead. I'm the only one here. I'm a solitary soul with a lot of things to share. <laughs> How you going there, mate? Well, yeah, you look terrified. You can see what he's doing there. He's got full lock to the left completely trying to fight that sand that's what you don't want to do so you just want to kind of stick with the sand he's trying to fight it too much he's on a full lock and there's just making things harder for him he's burying the car look at that see that front wheel there on just like full lock I was like, yeah, I was like, oh. Yeah, from the outside, you're on like a full left hand down lock. <laughs> Is that what was going on? And you're just like burying the car. <laughs> you need to straighten up your wheels. I was like, I was yeah, like, you're trying to turn feel? to the left to get away and you're just making it worse and worse right, and worse. Right, right, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's what was going on. Way down here on the beach here, down to this is Back Plumber or Queen's Head. Really nice spot down here, but um, it's pulled up for 10 minutes, have a bit of a look around. We're going to keep going. So we've got um, southerly winds today, and it's better here in northeast. There's also a whole lot of smoke around today because we've got really bad fires in there. We've had bad fires for weeks, like real bad. Um, basically, half of New South Wales is nearly on fire at the moment. We've had lots of local bushland, we've lost houses um, locally. So, yeah, not good times, but. That's why there's so much smoke around today. We just made it idiots of ourselves at the local beach and uh, flexed the car up onto the rocks here. How's it look? You get the shot? Yeah. We just drove the car up onto the rock here. I'm actually, I was actually interested to see how the suspension's go, going. I haven't really tested it out. Now, from what I can see, there's actually quite a bit more travel in the front end than on the old one, but the rear end is a little bit less. Now, I have the Super Pro adjustable rear sway bar that's on a medium adjust, adjustment at the moment, so 
it should get more travel than that out, out of the rear so what I'll do is I'll adjust it out to the max adjustment and that should um, give me that more travel in the rear but yeah we drove it up onto the rock here everyone was looking at us I feel like a complete wanker <laughs> but I got, got a few photos looks pretty cool. but we're gonna head off now and keep heading cruising up the coast Easy. Oh man, it's hard work. <laughs> Run the camera around. <laughs> Oh yeah, back up off the beach now. Hit the dirt road. Keep going till we get to the next beach. That was interesting though. Quite a bit more flex in the front. I'm guessing it's those uh, upper control arms giving it that more travel. And then a little bit less in the rear, but just need to adjust out that rear sway bar a bit. Give it some more travel. beaches we're just heading north so we started the town of Port Macquarie this morning we're heading north we came along all those uh, back beaches passed through uh, Plummer race course and now up here Crescent Head had a bit of lunch back at the park there and then Matt's showing us this cool cave just out the front of Crescent Head at the, uh, the uh, rocks headland area here we've never seen before what do you reckon? oh my look it goes all the way up Pretty there Watch out for bears. Yeah. <laughs> it's a ghost. Do we get you down? What is it? Oh, it looks like an old washed up like um, machine or something. Yes. Pass through a mallow. I'll take one for the team. I'll keep going. Yeah. Oh, it's like an old like, engine, eh? It's an engine? Yeah. Why is there an engine up in the cave? Yeah, I must have washed in you with a swell. That's weird. Why is there an engine up? Wait, come, come up. Let's see how far we can go. Yeah, man. Let's get killed. Are you sweaty? Yeah. Are you, get, are you filming now? I'm always sweating. Have you been filming? Yeah. Oh, are you filming? Yeah. Hey! Yeah, pretty sick cave. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. Pretty cool little cave in here, hey Kai? Yes. Oh, I think it's heavy. Are you doing CrossFit? Yeah. CrossFit! Basically. Why would you get this cave out of town? Nine and a half out of ten. Yeah. What do you get? Nine point six out of ten. Finish checking out the cave. We're gonna go hit the uh, sand tracks now, up the beach a bit. If I have to go third. Third? So, so like start right back there in second and then hit third on the flat bit. 
So where do I start? Back where you were. Yeah. To second, then whack it up to third, and yeah. then about 3,000 revs of third, straight up here. Ah, oh, so much sand. Alright, give me a go, you clown. You film. I just can't get up at eh? Yeah, I'll show you how it's done. That ended up being fourth gear low range I used to get up that. A little bit, uh, we need a little more air out of the tyres. At 16, you know, very often around 14, two, three more uh, for this sort of stuff. And then the sand's just like really dry because there haven't had any rain. And it's hot, dry, very, uh, I don't know, fine sand, whatever. It's, you know, it's uh, very soft. We're off, that, we're off that track down on the beach, down on the beach now, and we're going to uh, cruise on up the beach. How's all this ash on the beach but from the fires? This is all just from the fires, like all just leaves and ash and everything falling from the sky and then washed up on the beach. Sand dunes in the area, pretty cool. You can go check out. That's currently what our area looks like from space just whole clouds from all the fires, and then just smoke taking over the whole thing. This is us, we're down in here somewhere. So that's what's currently going on. Not definitely not good. You can see it all coming in like the sky's just darkening. This happens like it's just kind of in and out all day. And Oh, that's the best. What is it? 
band here out of this wind. Relaxing. And look at that nice calm bay. So nice to be out of that wind. After we came off the beach, we drove through to Pat Head because we've got a southeast wind today. It's nice and protected here. Smooth, calm. We're going to head out for a swim. We're just going to chill for a bit. We're all pretty worn out after today. Getting around in the wind and sun and cooked. The sun doesn't exist anymore these days. It's just replaced by smoke. So that's why it's always dark because the whole sky is just nothing but smoke. Are you going for a swim, Kai? Nope. Nope. Sun's gone red. It's actually really cool down here in the water. And because there's no sun, it's gone for the smoke. Finished up at the beach, it's about four in the hour, it's getting pretty late, we're going to out the tyres and then head home. Day is finished. Have fun mate. Yeah, it's a good day. Have fun Kai. No. Kai had so much fun. Kind of. I've never had so much fun. take off in four high and see how you go. So in four high you gotta rev it to get going. You can't just yeah. take off like idling otherwise it'll just stall. You so gotta you're first. First high and you gotta get that power up a bit to get going. So for higher but more revs? Yeah. And then bring your bring clutch out and rev it as you go. Rev 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 rev. Now take your foot off don't change, take your foot off the clutch, yeah. yeah. Now just relax. Just drive. No, just get the feel for it for a sec. Yeah. And then once you feel confident, get up to about 3,000 and then yeah. quickly whack it into second. Okay. And then hit it again. Yeah. Now don't change. Now yeah, just hold it. So you got to keep the you got to keep you got to keep the revs up. Yeah. So once again, when you're ready, you can get up to about 3,000 revs and whack it into third, keeping those revs going and hit the accelerate again as soon as you're in the third gear. 